in Dago, Africa, um, they do a bunch of these really, really cute hand woven bowls. And what I like about this, these are more expensive, but they're, I think, like made from artisans in Africa. So they're pretty authentic, which is really, really awesome. And they do a whole bunch of different um, variations on patterns and stuff on these woven bowls. And you can see like they're big enough to fit a ton of fruit in. We keep this on our uh, dining room table. And I like putting like apples and just whatever fruit we have on the table. I was looking for a good fruit bowl for a really long time. This is such a good deal. Everything is like super cheap today. I think it's even more than 15% off. So this is originally $70 which I feel like is expensive for a like woven bowl, but just knowing that it's hand woven and I'm pretty sure it's fair trade. Um, one of our cats is having like a panic chaos moment. So yeah, anyway, so it's fair trade, um, whatever, but uh, today it's $38, which again is like a really, really, big deal. Um, like I said, they come in a bunch of different really cute patterns. I picked this one because um, in our dining room, and as you can kind of see in, with our living room, like I have a lot of really bright statement pieces. So I like to pick more neutral accents that help tone down the space. But I just, I love the way like the pink looks with this woven um, bowl and yeah, we have a, like a giant thing of pink art in our dining room. So it's a just a really like nice match. But I think like with any bright solid color, you it would look really, really amazing. And I'm going to hold it up like this so you can see how shallow it is. It is pretty shallow, but it's wide so you can fit a lot. You know, you can fit a lot in it. Okay, moving on. I'll talk about one of my favorite things 